Justine Quiche couldn't hold it in and has an accident in the cage. I'm Jesus Jones. Be sure to subscribe to The Fumble for all the latest news on the UFC. Being a professional cage fighter means being put in all sorts of uncomfortable positions that test one's strength, willpower, and intestinal fortitude. Justine Quiche understood that challenge all too well. During her strawweight bout with Felice Harig at UFC Fight Night 112 in Oklahoma City, Quiche found herself in serious trouble when Harig trapped her in a tight rear naked choke. Quiche showed incredible resolve in fighting off the submission, but her efforts proved costly as it appears that she may have um, had an accident that left brown stains on the canvas. When the prince started leaving a trail, everyone in the arena was completely puzzled and curious to what was actually happening. After a few minutes, it was apparent it was indeed feces. But before you guys jump on the bandwagon and give her all this heat, it's worth noting that it isn't entirely clear how this happened, though Quiche did poke fun at the controversy later in the evening, tweeting, I am a warrior and I will never quit. Hashtag shit happens, haha, be back soon. <laughs> you have to give her some credit. Let me know in the comments below how you would have handled that if that would have happened to you. Keish isn't the first fighter to suffer this fate. Top middleweight contender Yoel Romero and former UFC heavyweight champion Tim Sylvia are among the competitors who have had to deal with mid-match bowel movements. So it happens to the best of us. Maybe not myself or you, but not many fighters admit it. Some of these guys really, you know, it's a normal thing. So props to Keish. At least she has a sense of humor about her unfortunate in-cage accident. Keish has a record of 6-1 with MMA and 2-1 with UFC, and after five Fighting her heart out for three rounds, once even coming seconds away from losing consciousness, she lost to a unanimous decision. Just one more thing to add to the list of potential hazards that fighters have to worry about every time they step in the cage. I have to ask, based on how the fight went down, do you think there was any way Keish could have prevented this? Let me know in the comments below. For all the best game and sports news highlights, make sure to hit subscribe. For The Fumble, I'm Denise Jones.